All right, night. So where we left off, um, we had to make amends with the uh, AU. Um, it was pretty, pretty interesting, if I do say so myself. Um, we had to do a lot um, for that one, cause uh, yeah, it was a pretty rough uh, patch that we had to cover up. But um, yeah, so uh, now everything's doing pretty good with the AU. Now we can continue. Let's get right back into it. My enduring love for AU. Reconfirmed. The pair of us sit together on the starlit beach. AU's Adur has since faded alongside her succubus attire. Now she's clad in the same casual clothes she's been wearing throughout this trip a cute off shoulder sh shirt and a pink skirt. <laughs> That's adorable, by the way. Really adorable. That's cute. AU snuggles close to me and then rests her head upon my shoulder. Her long hair tickles my cheeks, but I don't mind it. The weight of her body against my own is a comfort, and her warmth bleeds through her clothes. Through my own. I entwine AU's hand in mine, which is lying by my side, and she sighs appreciatively. It's a lovely night, don't you think? It sure is. The moon is especially beautiful, but it's made even more so when we're together. Oh, you. You're such a charmer. A giggling AU nudges me in the side with her elbow. AU's elbows are pretty pointy, much like her words, but she doesn't put enough force into the blow for it to hurt. She's being unusually gentle after her earlier meltdown. I'm glad I was able to console her. And it is nice to sit together like this, just the two of us. Hey, Hideki. Yeah. Something on your mind? It's nothing so important, really. I was just thinking. Um, a you inhales, stealing herself. Her eyes met mine. Bright violet, glistening beneath the milky moonlight. There's a pause, and then, I do, you know? Do what? Um, um, is this supposed to be some kind of proposal? Um, she doesn't want to get married, does she? I'd be flattered that were the case, but uh, it might cause a few problems with her career. Idols aren't supposed to get married. They aren't even allowed to go on dates. If she wants to walk down an aisle with me in a white dress, better put her career behind her I don't know if AU likes me all that much but my amusing it transpires were quite unnecessary most like 80% of the stuff which circulate about inside my mind I love you AU confesses her voice soft as a whisper I know. I act like I don't, but that's all a front. I'm afraid of being weak. And I'm afraid of being vulnerable. I've been in the spotlight for too long. My so-called fans scrutinize me. The tabloids too. And the TV talk shows. If I make a single mistake, they all descend upon me like vultures. I've had to learn how to be two-faced to survive. If I let what people say get to me, I'd never be able to get out of bed in the mornings. I act like a cute, bubbly airhead on stage, but I've hardened my heart against criticism for a while. I found it impossible, to be honest. I've been playing a character for a long time. But 
It's different when I'm with you. I know you won't judge me unlike the others. You make me feel safe. So, I can finally tell you how I really think and feel. Both the bad parts and the good. I love you. So please, don't leave me. I might be awkward and annoying and maybe I can't change, but I am working on it. I want to make you happy. You... I smile at her, then lean a little closer. I let my head rest on top of hers. Her, our fingers still intertwined and mutter into the stillness of the starry night. You don't need to worry about that. You do make me happy. I'm not going to go anywhere. You won't? Nah. But I'm nowhere near as affectionate as the others. Someone's always cooking for you. Cosmos is super lovey-dovey. And Marina and Hazel aren't at all self-conscious about expressing their feelings, but I am. I insult you when I don't mean it. And when you try to be affectionate, I pull away. The worst. No, you're not. You're just a little awkward, like you said, but I don't mind it. I haven't taken any of it to heart. But I have. Stop! Before you continue on with the video, I want to ask you guys a couple questions. Are you struggling with sleeping? Are you struggling with dehydration? Are you struggling with having energy in the morning, day, and night when it comes to gaming? I got a solution for y'all. Head on over to Poggers. This is going to be one of the few drinks that they actually released, and it's actually really, 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 really cool. Um, they even released their new flavor last month, which is Rocket Pop. Make sure to go ahead and check them out. Link in the description down below. Use creator code ZM for 10% off your order. Enjoy the video, everybody. I knew it was a Cinderay action, but of course, I was obviously joking within my exaggeration. <laughs> so, I didn't actually mean it. I knew she was being Cinderay, I knew she was being awkward. That's not really surprising. Although it can be annoying to me, it's not annoying to him, so. No harm in that, really. I've always known how you feel about me. You're not as good as hiding it as you might think. Uh, you scowls. For some reason, that's kind of annoying. I can be very annoying if I choose to be, but it is what it is. Your feelings to me are obvious, despite your constant proclamations to the contrary. So don't worry, I like you just as much as I like the others. They're all special to me. And I'm not gonna let you go. You promise? Promise. <laughs> Cross your heart and hope to die. I reply after a pause, but also touched by a used clinginess. It's rare for her to be this honest about her feelings. It's kind of adorable. I mean, sadistic part of me feels like teasing her, but a bigger part of me wants instead to respond to her sincerity in turn. I don't want to punish her for finally opening up to me. Cross my heart, and I mean it every word. I love you, and I want to see you. Well, of course you do. I should go without saying. <laughs> I'm Japan's top idol. Who wouldn't want to bask it in the lo my love and affection? You're a pretty lucky guy, Idigi. You should be counting your blessings. I already do. Every single day. You don't have to worry about that score, are you? <laughs> His face turns red, pouting. She glances away. I was trying to play it off, but you're even more cooler customer than I am. Your quips are way too good. <laughs> you're going to give me a heart attack if this keeps up. Should I stop saying nice things, though? No, no, you don't have to go that far. I like it when you compliment me, though. I know I don't often act like it. It's hard for me to admit my real feelings, but... He draws in a... Sorry, you draws in a shallow breath. 
I'm trying to get better. I really am. I hope you can bear with me, Hideki. Sure. I'll always be there for you. If you need somebody to vent to, look no further. I'm trying to be as supportive as I can for the sake of your career and our relationship. Thank you. The you smiles. Her violent eyes tremble with emotion. You might tease me from time to time, but I know you're a really great guy deep down. You're the best cameraman. No, the best boyfriend a girl could ever ask for. I really do love you. So saying, AU leans in and impresses her mouth to my own. Her kiss is sweet and gentle, in a direct contrast to her abrasive personality, and it's full of love. Her feelings are so palpable. I can taste them in her saliva and on her tongue. She really does love me. And I think after all we've endured to, uh, together, I love her too. How could I not? The Kiyu Yu is really adorable. For real. Well, I'm going to end it here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure you leave a like. Also, hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. This has been Zach, guys. Later.